Hey everyone, in the past I've spent Karma and Volatile Magic to see how much gold you can get from these currencies, but I've never done a video about Unbound Magic. I am curious to see if you can get a decent amount of gold from it, so I thought it would be interesting for me to check that out. There are pretty much three different ways you can potentially make gold off of Unbound Magic. Buying and salvaging acid and amulets, or buying the magic warp packets and bundles. Salvaging amulets is not really reliable though, it depends purely on your luck. When you salvage an Ascendant Amulet, you have a small chance of receiving a Salvaged Excellence, which is worth hundreds of gold, but the odds of getting one are very low. You would have to salvage a lot of amulets to have a decent chance, so it's not really worth it. As for the Magic War Packets, they mostly give low value materials like ore, logs, and cloth. They can also give you leather and a small chance for Ascendant materials, but overall, you will lose coal since they cost 50 silver each and the average loot you receive is much lower. Our best bet to make some gold will be with the magic warp bundles. Exclusively in Ember Bay, they cost about 50 silver each and the materials they give are often quite valuable. You can get tier 6 materials, lodestones and even mystic clovers. So we're going to go ahead and buy 800 of these bundles. It cost exactly 1 million Unbound Magic and 320 gold. Here we go. Let's see what we get from them. All shiny. Alright, so we managed to get 30 Mystic Clovers, that's pretty nice. We also got about a stack and some extra tier 6 materials, always nice to have those. Got a bunch of Lodestones as well, those tends to be pretty pricey. The total worth of all of the loot is 1161 gold, so we got a profit of about 841 gold. I guess that's not too bad. 1 million volatile magic does take quite a while to get, but this is pretty much the most reliable way to convert into gold. You just have to pray and receive rolls of mystic clovers or other expensive stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You can find a list of all of the loot I received with some additional details in the video description in case you're curious to know more. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.